Hi, it's me, Vamp, and welcome back or welcome to the channel. Now, I have a quick fix tutorial for you guys, and this should, not 100% sure, but it should fix your problem, because if you're like me, you'll have this problem from time to time with plugins. In Final Cut Pro, it will show this, which is basically saying that there's elements in the plugin that's missing. I know what you're thinking. Bam, I've tried the, you know, edit the file, add the updated version, my Final Cut Pro is updated, my Motion is updated, my version of, you know, Apple Mac is updated. Well, there's a simple fix for this, okay? And you will actually need, down here, you see I have a bunch of stuff going right now, but you will actually need motion for this, okay? Yeah, you will actually need motion. So what you'll need to do is you will need to find the plugin that you're trying to use. In this case, it's this one. And you hit open in motion, okay? Yes, you hit open in motion, motion will open. Unfortunately, like I said, you will need motion. And then you simply um, delete this one thing here, separators, okay? Just delete this whole separator thing. It won't mess with anything. It will keep everything still just the same. And then after you delete separated in, um, if you, it won't mess anything up, but if you're worried about it messing stuff up, you can always go to file, hit save as, enter a new name, enter a new location. I'm not going to do any of that because I actually already have stuff saved in the new location because I do do that stuff just in case. Like, I like using this one a lot. This is my go-to, right? It's not working right in this, as you can see. Well, I did the whole thing. I just recommend it to you guys with this. And it works exactly the same, but it actually works because it doesn't have that separator thing. Um, you heard a little bit of gameplay because I forgot there was sound on this before I started playing it. I apologize to you guys, but yeah. And like that, your issue should be fixed. Again, just whatever you are having trouble with, um, just go, um, open in motion, yes, open in motion, then delete that final thing that you, you know, need deleted, like right here. We've opened this one in motion, and then once it gets into motion, Delete the separators, okay? Don't delete anything else. Even if it's grayed out, don't delete it. Only delete the separators, okay? That's all you need to do. And then, you know, save as. If you want, you can close Motion and um, Final Cut Pro and reopen them, but you don't even need to do that technically. Um, so yeah, hopefully that has helped you fix your problem. I wanted to tell you guys about this because I know I ran into the same problem for so long. Luckily was able to find a fix for it. But yeah, with that said, I will catch you guys in the future. Later.